The shooting for Zoya Akhtar's upcoming film Gully Boy has concluded. Actress Alia Bhatt on Sunday night took to her Instagram stories to share that she would miss the film's set. And it's a film wrap for Gully Boy, going to miss this set too much. The best, best crew and all the best people. Love you all. Miss you already, Zozo and Tutu. Big hug. See you guys very soon, Alia wrote. She later shared a photograph of herself sporting a black t-shirt which had Gully Boy written on it. Gully Boy film wrap. She captioned the image. The movie, backed by Farhan Akhtar and Ritesh Sidwani's Excel Entertainment, is reportedly a coming-of-age story based on the lives of street rappers in Mumbai. Actress Sunny Leone made a promise to her elder daughter Nisha that she will protect her from all evil. Sunny adopted Nisha last year from an orphanage. In a tweet posted on Saturday, Sunny addressed a note to Nisha saying, I promise with every ounce of my heart, soul and body to protect you from everything and everyone who is evil in this world. Even if that means giving my life for your safety. Children should feel safe against evil, hurtful people. Let's hold our children a little closer to us. Protect at all costs. Sunny and her husband Daniel Weber are also parents to twins Asha and Noah, who were born via surrogacy this year. Sunny's tweet arise in the wake of nationwide outrage over the rape and murder of an 8-year-old child in Khatua. In strongly worded tweets, celebrities like Sonam Kapoor, Karan Johar, Akshay Kumar, Kalki Koichlin, Farhan Akhtar, Richa Chadha and many others also condemned the heinous crime on social media and asked for justice. The entire nation including Bollywood celebrities have shaken by the horrific rape incidents in Jammu and Kashmir and Uttar Pradesh. Where some have come out on the streets protesting for the horror, others have taken to their respective social media accounts holding placards asking justice for the 8-year-old, one being Kareena Kapoor Khan. However, this Viradi wedding star was trolled for marrying a Muslim and for naming her son Temur. A social media user wrote, She should be ashamed of the fact that despite being a Hindu, is married to a Muslim, has a child with him and named him Temur after a brutal Islamic barbarian. Swara Bhaskar, however, defended, saying, You should be ashamed you exist, that God gave you a brain which you choose to fill with hate and a mouth you choose to spoof filth from. You are ashamed on India and Hindus, that shits like you feel emboldened to talk this crap publicly in this government's legacy. Actress Kangana Ranaut says she is not on social media because she finds it very consuming. Kangana expressed her thoughts on social media when she became part of TV show VH1 Inside Access, a statement to IANS said. I am not on social media for many reasons and one of them is that I feel it's so consuming. People tell me, open an account because some of them can be brand queries and they want you on social media. It's mandatory. Sometimes your agent tells you, just open an account or don't post or let us post. That's not okay with me because I have not done anything in my life where I am not involved. I can't imagine the fact that I am being dishonest on some level that someone else is pretending to be me. I am faking that with millions of people and it's sort of having a fake relationship. On the work front, she is busy with Mani Karnika, the Queen of Jhansi, and will also star in Mental Hai Kya along with Rajkumar Rao. It's been 25 years for Anil Kapoor and Sri Devi star of movie Roop Ki Rani Choro Ka Raja, where Anil Kapoor is missing his co-star, late actress Sri Devi, Satish Kaushik on the other hand, who began his journey as a film director with the said movie, apologized to producer Bonnie Kapoor for delivering a box office failure that left him broke. Anil wrote, Can't believe it's been 25 years for Roop Ki Rani Choro Ka Raja. I remember the obstacles that we faced during the shooting of this film and after as well, but it was still a memorable journey. We miss the Roop Kirani every day. Whereas Kaushik tweeted, 25 years ago it was a disaster at the box office, but it was my first child and will remain close to heart. Remembering Madam Shri Devi and my sorry to Bonnie Kapoor, who gave me a break but was broke after the film. Kaushik's Twitter post generated mixed responses, with some social media users agreeing with him about how the movie fared, while some lauded it for its technical values.